I've never <laughs> been to altitude. I've never been to altitude. I've been there. Is it fun? Yeah, it's a foam pit. Okay. <laughs> so is that a question? It might have been a you question. You've been in a foam pit? No. no. Yeah, me either. I want to go. Let's go. But you just okay, so, guys. Oh, well, this there. has been a good episode. Uh, if you uh, are listening live right now, catch us at altitude. We'll be at okay, altitude. Bye. Picks or get the fun on. Get that fun on. Get on up. Yeah. Other than that, I went on a couple dates. And they were wonderful. Yeah. Yeah. With the same person or different mm-hmm. people? Same person. A couple days. Is it that that girl who just started following the? uh, Uh huh. Yeah. Yeah. I had a feeling. Shout out. I'm smitten. (laughs) Yeah. (laughs) So I want to see what y'all know about your presidents. Uh oh. Mm, I don't know any. So I'm going to ask you a question, and I want to see if you guys know what president this is about. Okay. Okay. Oh dear. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um. Let's see. Where where was I? Where are you, are you on like presidentialfacts.net? <laughs> <laughs> um is this a GeoCity site? <laughs> yes. It's yes an, it is. It's an angel fire. I from, found out that there's a GeoCities sites torrent. You can download all no shit. of the really? GeoCity sites. Wow. That's weird. That ever existed. That's real weird. Or at least it existed when they shut down GeoCities. <laughs> all right. So this president and his family wandered aimlessly in the woods for hours before finally finding their way to their new home at the White House. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to say George Washington. George Washington? It's got to be, right? I'll give you guys a hint. I have a distant relation to this president. That's not really a hint at all. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's just another random trivia fact. Um, yeah, <laughs> <laughs> some people might know. I've talked about it openly before. Is it a Roosevelt? Was that your guess, the Roosevelt? I guess no. He's pretty recent. He would know where the White House is. I think <laughs> you, you never know. Um, well, I think George Washington. I don't think the White House existed yet. Mm. Mm, good point. Um, I don't know. I'm gonna go with Millard Fillmore. <laughs> <laughs> it was actually John Adams. Oh John no, shit! Man, that was my even. I didn't guess. know that. I was going to guess John Adams. Yeah. Hey, can we go back? Is it John Adams? <laughs> Is it John Adams? Yeah, I know, you got it right. <laughs> Way to go. See, we're um, in control of time here. Got it. If you I love hadn't it. realized. So can you go way back in time and give me my 16-year-old ass back? Because I'd, I'd really appreciate that. <laughs> uh, we, we only control the hour in which we were going right. for. Right. All right. I got another one. Uh <laughs> Sheep were raised for wool on the White House lawn during this president's term. I'm going to go with Millard Film. <laughs> <laughs> Why is that so funny? Well, you just keep going with it. Anybody else? Anybody else got a guess? I don't think so. I don't know. Man, no very, idea. Very much about presidents. It was Woodrow Wilson. Ah, so that's, that was my second guess. <laughs> that's in the 1900s. So I was like, going to say that wasn't that though. No. <laughs> wow. If I knew Woodrow Wilson, I would know that he loved sheep. All right. We're going to do two more. Two more. Is one of them going to be really obvious? Do you want a really obvious one? Yeah. Just so I can feel better about myself. <laughs> This president collects Spider-Man and Conan the Barbarian comic books and was known as Obamber during his high school basketball days. Why was Obama known as Obamber? I'm sorry, Obamber. Because he was bombing the ball. He would bomb it into the hoop. Okay. You got a guess? (laughs) Take a guess. Uh, This president was the last president of the Whig Party. (laughs) <laughs> Is it Miller Fillmore? <laughs> ding, ding, ding. <laughs> All right. Um, I was going to say, though, that he would be the only president to have those comic books. Yeah. I, I just love that he's a comic book fan. Yeah. Everybody else has guns and, and cows. All right. I got one more. I got one more. Steve seems to have more. This president and his cabinet members helped fight the Library of Congress fire. Hmm. Is it a Roosevelt? (laughs) (laughs) I'm going to guess Teddy. Theodore Roosevelt. Good old Teddy. Mm -hmm. 
That is my dude. What do you think, Steve? Um, is it uh, <laughs> Miller <laughs> Fillmore? <laughs> hey, Mom, Miller, you got a guess? <laughs> I like Teddy Roosevelt. I think that's a good guess. It's Miller Fillmore. No. <laughs> Congratulations, Steve. I think you have the highest score. What would you, <laughs> what would you like as your uh, prize? Um, a wig. A wig? Okay. A wig. <laughs> From the wig party? A powdered wig? Or? Actually, I'm really not into that guy. I just like the name Millard. It's a great name. Mm-hmm. Hey, was it sweet enough? This is the best I can it get. It wasn't that sweet. It's not a very good picture, but... The Candyman. Oh, yeah, can. that's what your butthole looks like? It would be if I were to get a butthole tattoo of Candyman. I can't even think of, yeah, like... that's valid. What... Anything on this earth that would be, like, that would be the perfect <clears throat> butthole tattoo. Top five butthole tattoos. A minion. <laughs> let's, let's Google this. the eye is, you a know... A minion. Uh, the, min- the, the butthole is in the minion's eye. Yeah. Um, this is getting weird. Butthole. Well, you invited me here. Tattoo. <laughs> <laughs> butthole tattoos on Google. No. Images. Just do the top, the first five. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Wow. What is it? Is that a oh, spider crawling out of it? It's just a spider butthole. Huh. Is that the winner? No, I don't know. So. That's the first one that shows up. This one is just a tattoo of a butthole. <laughs> Yeah. It's not just a butthole, but can you get a tattoo of a butthole on your butthole? Uh, I don't think probably. Ooh, I watched this video. This is some woman getting it's a video of some woman getting a
by a whale. <laughs> I don't know. That sounds fucking terrifying. Yeah. All right. Uh, there is one person. Uh, who is <laughs> How the fuck are there two Batmans in my basement right now? <laughs> it's, they're bat- it's Batman with a side order. Justice. Would with it really a side be order. Batman though? Because I mean, Batman. I mean, would it be Batman? <laughs> because they're not like, oh, they're Batman. No, it's like you're Batman and you're Batman. So we're Batmans. <laughs> well, it's like X Men, like Radio Edit. And we're Batman. They're X Mans. X-Men. I know, but what about X-Men the X-Men? Is it what about the X-Men? You don't just who look is at X-Men. You don't look at Wolverine and go, "Oh, look, there's an X-Man." No, you Wolverine. <laughs> <laughs> just made me think about some weird. Hey, there's superheroes. one of the X-Men. Yes, that's how you'd say it. Right, so it's X-Men is a collective, but there's no Batman collective. I mean, there might be, but they're not there's superheroes. only one Batman. Right, and there are just two of them here. But if so we're Batman. If we're gonna join a team, I think we're Batmans. I think so too. We're Bat people. I'm not. <laughs> are, you, are you a non-binary Bat person? It could be either. Right? It's a fine. Bat X Man. A gender fluid Bat person. I'm yes. into that. It's cool. DC should get into that. They've got a lot of people in the Bat family. That's they cool. should just have Bat person. It's just a non-binary. <laughs> I mean, yeah, they sure. should. Sure, be more inclusive. Sure, guys. I thought we were talking about Wall. I just feel like it would turn. Into- <laughs> <laughs> like, what happened here? Yeah, let's talk about. That's Wally. a good movie. Who's you your favorite? Seen- who's your favorite Wally? Yep, yep. Uh, I had four uh, buttermilk Eggo waffles. I love um, waffles, and a cup of coffee. Sublime. Yeah, it was pretty good. If you if you guys refer to the chat, uh, you'll see how I presented everything. It looked beautiful. Thank you. Uh, me and my uh, Animal Crossing character ate breakfast together. Nice. Very nice. Yeah. Yeah. I've actually been saving. I've got some cinnamon toast waffles in the freezer. Ooh. Ooh. I'm saving them for that day when things get real fucked up and I have to cook them and eat them all at once. <laughs> <You're> <laughs> all not- 12 waffles. All at once. Let's go. Hey, let go of my ego. <laughs> Stand down. Let go of my ego. <laughs> oh, I'm in, a, I'm in a fucking wire mess here, boys. Look at this. Wire it up. Look at this <laughs> wire. <laughs> a fucking Maybe wire put the other I Bud in. I don't want to. Put in the other Joe Budden. <laughs> oh, haven't heard that name since high school. Well, I have, but I've paid attention to the rap game lately, so. Yeah, is he doing good? He's got a podcast and he does pretty well. He Last I knew he was signed to Shady Aftermath. Okay. Is yeah. that... Dr. Dre and Marshall Mathers. Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, now wow. I uh, now I understand Eminem. Yeah. What? M.M. Marshall Mathers. Wow. Wow. <laughs> wow. You just figure that out too, Devin? Yeah. 